Welcome back. Joining us virtually is our friend Fran Phoenix over at Clico. Fran, good afternoon. Thank you so much for being here virtually with us today. Good afternoon and thank you for having me, Taylor. Of course. So, okay, it's getting colder. We're talking about ways that people at home can lower their energy bills. I mean, we're talking a little bit during the break. A lot of people might not realize the perfect temperature to set their home at. Definitely. Taylor, 68 degrees is the recommended temperature in the winter. We know that may not be possible for all homes and businesses, but that is the recommended temperature for the winter season, 68 degrees. So if you can do that, please, by all means, that's going to help your um, energy usage. You're going to not use as much energy because the AC system is one of the bigger users, you know, in terms of what pulls um, usage or makes that meter work. It's going to be big ticket items like that. So definitely we recommend 68 degrees. And what are some other helpful tips that you can offer a viewer so they're not shocked when they get their energy bill this month? Definitely. Although the temperature in Louisiana, as you know, Taylor, is fluctuating, mm -hmm. you know, for Christmas it was hot and warm and <laughs> yeah. then a couple of days ago it got really, really cold and I think it's going to drop again. So what we really want we want to share those tips that customers can use because we are officially in the winter season, even though we have some very um, what you would call up and down temperatures. But when the temperatures do drop, definitely look and find leaks. If you have leaks in your home, you want to seal them up because that will keep the heat indoors. You also want to inspect and replace your air filters. A dirty air filter can cause your system to have to work harder. You want to do that monthly. You want to use what's called LEDs. These are the new bulbs. They're brighter. They last longer. They're more energy efficient. You want to install a programmable thermostat if you can. That will help lower your energy usage. And, of course, open your drapes and your shades and your curtains during the day to take advantage of the solar heat. Mm -hmm. And at night, close them to keep the heat indoors. This is all great advice. Fran, thank you so much for coming on the show virtually to help our viewers at home kind of make sense of their energy bill and how they can lower it. If people want to learn more, how can they? Definitely. You can visit Clico.com, take advantage of the great programs under our PowerWise Energy Efficiency Program. We have more tips on our website, and you can also visit Clico on Facebook at Clico Power. Fran, thank you so much for joining us virtually this afternoon. Thank you, Taylor. Have a good one. You too. Stay warm. And if you at home want to learn more about these tips, head to our website, klaf.com. Before we go to break, though, we got to check in with Adam Olivier. Well, we're seeing some warm temperatures out there right now, but there are going to be some big changes on the way in the hours ahead. I'll tell you more about that coming up.